So with these Krovals, you know, we've put out thousands, and I mean thousands of these Krovals. And you know, with any product, you're gonna have a handful of issues that come up. But here's the great thing. Every issue that we have come up, we've turned that into a positive and we've used it to make this product tougher so that now our first responders that are out there raving about it, loving it, special forces guys that love this tool, now that they have an opportunity to see what we can do in modifying this and making it a stronger and better tool. This is the latest version of what we've come up with. And it's not all my ideas, honestly, it's your guys' ideas. You're the ones that said, hey, this one needs to be stronger. I need a more curved head. I need this, I need that. Everything has been through the suggestions that we get from you guys. So we love everybody's feedback because that only makes a tougher product. This is gonna be the toughest shovel and who knows what else we could make, eventually make with this thing. But right now, this is the one, this is the one I wanna go and show you just how tough this Krovel Extreme 2 is. 4140 hardened chromoly, hardened chromoly wings as well, welded front and back. You've got a grade 8 um, all thread that's been beefed up in there. Of course the washers, bolts all been upgraded as well. Down here our hammerhead. Even our hammerhead we're coming out with some new versions of this. And of course we have the two versions of the spike now. One of them given to us by special forces. Thought hey this would be good if we could reverse it. All those ideas that come from you guys and we appreciate it. Keep them coming. But let's do a little demo. See what this thing can do right? All right, hey guys, I, I can't go out into an exotic location on this shot because this just came in, so I wanted to get this tested as quick as I can. We're out behind the Gear Up Center uh, store, and I thought we'll just grab the first piece of hard Arizona dirt and start digging and uh, chopping, and we got some other things to destroy so we can show how tough it is. But let's just start off with just a regular straight shovel dig here. Got some serious rocks in there. Arizona soil for you. Oh my God, it's ridiculous. All right, now let's flip it over to do some picking. You know, the great thing is when you're picking with this thing, with this, really gives your hand a, a nice leverage when you're swinging away. You just gotta be stronger than your shovel. All right. Let me slap on my spike, show you some other stuff with this. So, this is testing out our nice little Z spike option on here to uh, pretend like we're getting out of a building. Pretty cool, yeah? Crazy. 
that's pretty tough. Quickly about these ADZ hammerhead. Um, it's really an ancient design. It's been around since caveman era, really. Um, it's used for woodworking. It's sent not sharp, all right, but it can be sharp. I leave it to you to make it as sharp as you want it to be and that you're comfortable with. This one hasn't been sharpened at all. I use it more for breaching and stuff. But if I were in the wilderness, I would put an edge on this really quickly. And if you're gonna do extended woodwork, for, by all means, that's why we made this head removable so you could take this off and then all you're really wielding is a great crowbar and a hammer um, it's about 18 inches so you've got a good piece of equipment because um, I've had guys say oh well this could hurt me well yeah take the head off and then you're gonna use the tool the right way but this thing is pretty good watch I mean just be able to whack it in there I'd like to see you try that with your e-tool. That doesn't happen. On a Crowville, you could do it. So now we're going to uh, be able to work out the uh, blade edge of this shovel. Now, being this is the 4140 hardened chromoly, it's really tough. So splitting wood is really not a, uh, really a tough thing at all. So I just took what this is off and it's not even a challenge for this thing. So here we go, let's try a little chopping. That's going through the board and the nails too, why not? Did it really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so my crap, look at that. Taking that one up. Ready? Yep. Nice. Now that went, like I said, that went right through the board and the wood. Take a look. So when we cut, not only did we cut the wood, I cut the nail in two. Open it again. That's what I do to get my aggressions out in the mornings here at Crowville. All right, let's try this one. I'm gonna go through all of the the nails and the wood as well. makes kindling <laughs> okay get a close-up on our our Crowville a few scratches nothing that a file saw couldn't get back to razor sharp in about 10 minutes all right this is a blunt force tool right here test it yourself this is a new Crowville extreme 2 by Gear Up. Go check us out, gearupcenter.com. <laughs>